Hey guys, this is a Lightkeeper task guide for returning the favor. For this task, you have to eliminate 15 PMCs around the mountain area on woods. And once you do complete this, then you will get two additional subtasks to hide two of the Terra Group blue folders in specific locations around the USEC camp on woods. So for the PMC kill portion of this task, then you can wear any gear as well as use any gun that you want to or are comfortable with. And in the background, I do have some examples on the screen of builds that I find to be versatile as well as effective when my goal is PVP. But remember that in Tarkov, ammo is king, so even though you may have a meta gun build, at the end of the day, the ammo that you're using is equally, if not more important than the gun build itself. It is important to note that you just have to make sure that the PMCs are located within this relative area for the kills to count. It really doesn't matter if you are actually outside of the zone shooting into it. Literally, the only thing that matters is that the kill shot has to land while the enemy PMC is within the zone. And I will also clarify that the kills will count even if the PMCs are up or down around the base of the mountain. It does not literally have to be around the mountain area. So even if the PMCs are up on top of Sniper Mountain where the Sniper Scav usually is, then you can definitely take them out and then they will still count as progress for you. Now, once your eliminations are completed, then you will be able to take the blue folders up to the USEC camp in order to plant them. Now, in order to get these folders, then you can find them in safes or drawers, or they can also be found in various different spots on Lighthouse. But most people do seem to have luck inside of or on top of building number two at the water treatment plant. And it is also possible that you can just buy them from the flea market for usually around 600k. So once you have your blue folders, then we will be heading back to woods with the intent of going back up towards the USEC camp areas. And then firstly, we will be heading to the big USEC camp area or the one with the black SUV at it. And then we will be actually heading up towards the black SUV in order to plant the first folder, which is going to be in the front passenger seat. And it is a 35 second timer for each plant. Now, once you've completed this first plant, then we will be heading over to the smaller USEC camp that does have the stretcher and then also the med tent. And then to the left side of this tent, then there is actually a satellite next to a wooden box where you can plant the second blue folder. And it is again going to be another 35 second timer. After you successfully planted both of these blue folders, then you will have the task completed. And then you can return to Lighthouse and cross the bridge and head up to Lightkeeper in order to hand the task in. Now, if you do happen to die while planting one of the blue folders or in between planting the first and the second one, then you can just return to woods in order to finish the plant that you weren't able to complete. Or even if you do happen to die while you load into Lighthouse to go and hand in the task to Lightkeeper, then you can just load back into Lighthouse and then go and hand in the task. So hopefully you guys found this guide useful and it did help you to complete this task. Thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching this video. If you're still here at the end, I definitely appreciate you and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day. So what you're seeing on the screen right now is just a couple of my different social links in case you guys wanted to connect more easily. I am primarily streaming on Twitch now multiple nights a week. So if you do want to connect with me or my community, that would probably be the easiest way to do so. And if you do come over to the Twitch and you want to join the Discord community, then just type exclamation point Discord or cord in the chat in order to get an invite link. And if you don't use Twitch, then I do have a link in the picture as well as a link below in the description. And we are growing and currently have an active and welcoming community with people of all experience and skill levels. So there will always be someone who could help to answer any questions that you may have. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching the video, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day.